you didn't have to push start it you could crank, crank start. it yeah that's so where the crank it inside yeah, the, or no, outside, right outside by the, the front, front part. yeah yeah that like a hole, hole. Thing, like a keyhole thing yeah. like and you had a crank in the trunk yeah right that if the car if a battery run down for whatever yes. reasons or the car stall yeah and you want to start it um, you're pushing oh, the crown. Difficult. Very difficult. <laughs> I was a young son. <laughs> <laughs> your poetry was what, Richard? Leather. It was, it was leather. leather. Yes, Predominantly sure? leather. I'm telling you. Yes, it was because, leather. Um, because the, the, the door cards were leather, right? Yeah, leather, red. right? Um, but very, very similar to the leather. Yes, exactly. If you know about WWV, if you're alive in these times, can you tell me some of the programs that would be on WWV and what the next one name? Uh, JBC or Radio Fusion. Or Radio Fusion. Yeah. I'm just hearing about Radio Fusion. Beautiful island of Jamaica. And we're going to talk about old time Jamaican taxis. Beside me is Richard Simpson and Winston Marshall. All right, guys. My memory says that, well, I wasn't alive then, the but it would have been. Obviously. <laughs> you know, you're the old man in my life after me, right? Yeah, was... So it would have started at Morris Oxford. Morris yeah. Oxford yes. and Austin, Austin Cambridge. Cambridge. Austin Cambridge. What's yeah. the difference though? Because the two of them shape the same. Yeah, and BMC. more or less, they were they were both um, British Leland cars. Yes. yes. And um, there was a slight difference in like the tail light, but mostly the, the, the cars were they had the same chassis, so, so to speak. Aust so Austin Cambridge had a fish tail. Yeah. I remember that. And the, and the yes, Austin Cambridge, um, the Morris Oxford had a more rounded exactly, yes. tail light se right. section. Yeah. Okay, uh, then. Yeah. Um, same price range? Same yes, price yes, range. Man. What was it? Was downtown? Who was it? Um, John Crook. John Crook on John Hanover Crook. Street. On Hanover really? Street. Yes. 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 So wait, yes. yes. John Crook was around for a very long time, right? Oh, a long, yes. long time. Oh, yes. But they, yes. were, they were among the first. Um, car importers you had the very very first car importer was KIG Kingston Industrial Garage okay. are you and serious they were the four dealers they, wait and they have been around so long they yes, were the, man. yes yes KIG is actually the first um subsidized or outside car dealer yeah Ford car dealer in the world what year what talk about this now 19 60s. no 19 oh like whoa whoa. Whoa, um, whoa, whoa, whoa whoa just before what? the second world war yeah yes yeah so so Kirk john is, crooks then yeah john crooks was the person then who did the uh, austin cambridge austin, austin cambridge yes, no yeah. no i would think that it would it would have been hard to own a car them time little right oh yes middle class people um government like managers mm -hmm. in the government mm -hmm. um, places yes give me uh, give me a press Give me kind of from a perspective standpoint, like what would a car like an Austin Cambridge cost to a house, like the ratio? What would that be? Like a person, it would what would be a house cost then and what would a car a cost? A house then? then would have been an average middle class house, three bedrooms, like Muna. Um, two by two, uh, no, two, two, yeah, two bathroom. Um, is about a thousand pounds. All right. Wow. A thousand pounds. About a thousand pounds. And um, I, know. I remember I used to work pounds. as a um, after school holidays yeah. as a government um, temporary worker. Yeah. Seven pound twelve and six was the pay per week. Big. <laughs> I remember that. Yeah, yeah. And my father was the superintendent of prisons. Yeah. I don't think he got much much more than that. Yeah. But he got free housing yeah. and the rest of the, in fact I remember in Healthcare. front of GP now. Mm -hmm. All the officers used to live on that ho on the houses on the opposite side, and we used to have five prisoners come over every day and clean the house and do the yard and everything. So wait, I do remember. You feel that. was it safe to have prisoners? Yes, that because they were accompanied by a warder. Okay. And were do you recognize any of these items? Well, test your Jamaican knowledge at KareemsQuest.com. And they were like first offenders, uh, right? They weren't hardened criminals. My grandfather used to tell me, say, your prisoners used to bake too. Yes, they used to have a, um, a bakery. A, yeah. Yes, I used to go and collect bread for my family at Spanish Town when my father was a superintendent there, the, one of the best bread in town. Okay. And there was a jimbling tree right in front of the prison on the opposite side. Yeah. Nicest jimbling you could ever find. I was like six years old at the time. <laughs> And so go pick the gym building and wait for the bread to come out and thing. Yeah, yes, yes. So, yes. so now the house is a thousand pound, right? Mm -hmm. yes. What's the car like? 
pounds. A but car would be about 200 pounds, 230 pounds for a brand new yeah. Morris Oxford mm -hmm. and maybe 235 pounds for a brand new Austin Cambridge. Very slight yeah. um, price, uh, price difference. Yes. Yeah. And um, the guarantees were the same mm -hmm. and service cost is, would be about the same. So, the same? Yeah. Okay yeah. then. So you buy a car like that new because it, it, it wasn't taxes then, it was just for that thing, No, right? at the time they, did, exactly. they, they didn't, taxes weren't prevalent, you know. Um, yeah. Buses were very... The, 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 the uh, public the transportation was system existing. was, was yeah. buses. So GOS was very efficient too. Yeah. Yes. yes. So persons, efficient. if you want to see my GOS um, video that I did with Cecile Clayton, who is an excellent historian, just look in my video section for this and you can see her article as well as the very good interview that she did for my YouTube channel. She talked about the bus route, then she talked about the Chichi Sound, every single yes. thing like that for the GOS buses. So you said the GOS buses were very good at the time. Yeah. Right? On no. time, mm -hmm. they had a schedule mm -hmm. at the bus at the bus terminus, mm -hmm. and you could see the schedule what time the bus coming okay, in. Nice. It was so good. Yeah, Trust yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Unlike good. now. Yeah, yeah, I get you. Yes. So I mean, all right. So back to these cars now. So. Talk, talk to me about a new car. You're owning a new Morris Oxford now, right? Mm -hmm. How long before you have to service it? What was that like? Well, you had a book, right, Richard? Yeah. You had a little book. A handbook. And that tell you a everything. Mm -hmm. But I tell you something. My father's car was a two-tone. Um, <laughs> light blue on the top and dark blue on the bottom, right? Yeah. Two that was a was, special. That was, was special. the shot yeah, of yeah, the deal. Yeah. Yes, man. When you're, you have you're a tone, step above. You're, you're, you're yeah. big. <laughs> Usual cars were like either yes. white, yeah. gray, or yeah. black. Or black, yes. So, how right. get a two tone? I don't know. Because I he was the superintendent yeah. of, of, oh, of I must have services. That, and, you know? <laughs> you know? Yeah, and he probably but knew. That, but uh, boy, zero to 16, mark. about 28 seconds, you know? What was the engine size like? Because I think it was like 1,000 or so? No, no, it was 13, between 13 and, and 1,500 yeah. cc's. Okay then. But very, very talky. Those cars had maybe about 53 um, horsepower, Yeah. but 60 foot-pound of torque. Oh, at that time, it yeah. was yes, more yeah. than um, horsepower. And they were, yeah. they were predominantly three-speed. Yes. And so I call yeah. it three on three the three. Three-speed on the, on the color. On the color. Okay yes. then. Yeah. Mm. Right. Yes. One up, two down, three forward Reverse and your, away, your, your, and, your, your, yeah. pull it and and go down and way. back. Uh -huh. Yeah. Yes. What was the interior? Tell me, take me through the interior technology now. Did they you were, have a radio? No, you didn't get a radio standard. But radios um, at the time, you must remember the radio stations in Jamaica it was like two. Two radio fusion. Yeah, you had radio fusion, and you had um, Jamaica Broadcasting Corporation. Hold it right, there's a persons. If you remember Radio Fusion and any big show or, or any big um, something that they would have on Radio Fusion, you please let us know in the <laughs> comment section and jo Jamaica Broadcast. All I know is like things like uh, Ring Ding and Marling Rider. That was long after. Yeah, long yes, after. All right, person. Yes. But if you know anything that would have been taking place in their era, you write that please in the comment section. So Radio Fusion and Jamaica Broadcasting. broadcasting yes. yes. So yeah, so the cars them now, it wouldn't have radio? No, and no. AC, no AC. You had and a radio pivot window at the side. Yes. yes. So if you want AC, you open the pivot window. And tilt it forward. Air, yes. So, so the, the air, air came in. The flex yes. inside. Okay. And, and all um, radios, all radio stations at the time were were AM, not FM. Right. Really? AM, yeah. AM only. Yes. AM mono. Yeah. It didn't have stereo, AM mono. And um, you also had WWV, which was another shortwave. Oh, but that was no. Persons, if you know about WWV, if you are alive in these times, can you tell me some of the programs that would be on WWV? And what's the next one name? Uh, JBC or Radio Fusion. Or Radio Fusion. Yes. I'm just hearing about Radio Fusion from Radio you. Fusion. Yeah. I never hear about Radio Fusion. So if you know any yeah. other programs that were on Radio Fusion or WWB on the AM dials at that time, because right. it would have only AM. FM. FM there was no FM, yeah. yes. Okay, then all right, go yeah. on. Yeah, so there's no radio in the car? There's no radio in the car. A radio would be a very, very special thing in the Your car. Your father would have probably have radio in a film car. Oh, definitely. I don't remember. Your father would have radio. Two -tone. As a two-tone. Yeah. The upholstery was what, Richard? Leather. It was, it was leather. leather. You're Predominantly sure? Predominantly leather, I'm telling you. Yes, it was because, leather. Um, because the, the, the door cards were leather, right? Yeah, leatherette. Right. Um, but very, very similar to the leather. Yes, exactly. Yes. And um, 
for comfort, yeah. you know, yeah. um, very plush mm -hmm. for a for a a middle car a, a middle class car. Yeah. Um, and plush, plush of holes, um, carpet. Carpet. Yes. What? Yeah, so, wait, so when not, not plush, plush, you know, but mm. it was it was a flat like the ones. Or, no. or, 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 or a rubber mat. Oh. It was a carpet. Yes. So yes. Which made it different. When you step in a mud and step on that, who cleaned Well, that? you had you had mats that you put down. You put yeah. down a mat in the car. And oh. somebody who owned a car at that time, you can't just come with your foot and come jump in the car. <laughs> it don't work, sir. Even if you're a family member. Yeah. That don't work. That don't work? No. Yeah. Oh my you, you goodness. You have to, you have to, um, you know, make sure and, that your shoes are proper. And some rubber mats were, were sewn into the carpet, weren't yeah. they? Yeah. Oh. Yes. Right. Right below the heels of right. the, the exactly. footwell. Yeah. Yes. That I do remember. Yeah. So how frequently would six persons be in that car? Because you said Ben seats front, Ben seats back. Normally familiar when we're going when I was going to Calabar, we used to live in Doheny Park. Mm -hmm. So myself, my sister, my father, and we used to pick up like people along the way. Like some of my schoolmates. Really? So yes. Yeah. We had a different these, Jamaica them time. People stop and pick up people. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. It was, yeah. And it was those different. cars had a very large rear passenger shelf. Yeah. Yes, oh yes. With, with, a, a, with a dog. Yes. With a dog. With, <laughs> yeah. a, with a wagging head wagging on there. That, that was or, SOP. Or as right? children. What is SOP? Standard operation. <laughs> you know, a dog yeah. and the head is on a swivel. Yeah. So every time the car, you see the dog head yeah. moving around. <laughs> they still sell them now. Yes. Yes. But sir. even then, yes, back then also, it was a privilege <laughs> to be able to climb up there as a youngster, yeah. three years old, and sit down. Yes. And you can look out and you're looking up at the sky when your father driving and so on. Really? And yeah. What was that the trunk space like? Big oh, man. massive. Very big. Massive, Very big. massive. And the, I would the say spear was under, right? Yeah, you yeah. had to wind down a thing to, to get let, the spear. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And, yeah, those, and those cars, you didn't have to push start it, you could crank start. Crank it, yeah. So where the crank it? Inside yeah, the, or outside? No, right outside by the, the bumper. Front. Yeah. Yeah, that like a hole, hole. Thing, like a keyhole thing, yeah. like, and you had a crank in the trunk. Yeah. Right. That if the car, if a battery run down for whatever yes. reasons, or the car stall, yeah. and you want to start it, um, you push How in the crank. How hard was that to wind up? Difficult. Very <laughs> difficult. I was a youngster, but and I said, big man. Yeah. Oh, crank and crank and crank. And a lot of people broke know. their hands from cranking because yeah. when the car start, oh, yes. the crank would still yes, go. Right. So you must know when you hear when you hear it fire, yeah, you draw back, draw back the crank. Uh -huh. If you hold on the crank in there, the crank is going to turn because the yes. engine has really started and, and you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. So yeah, yeah that's, that's another problem. Okay. okay then. And then after that, yeah. after those cars, like five, six, seven, eight, ten years, um, they became um, taxes. taxes. Right. People were now so farming instance, taxis companies. If you, if you have ever taken a Morris Oxford taxi, write that in the comment section for me, all right? Let me know what was your experience like. So 10 years now, it do its course, it starts to become a taxi, right? Yeah, yeah but you're still, like but you are still be able to, to buy a brand new one. Okay. Um, the models didn't change just a year. Um, and the looks didn't change that, that much, much either. Yeah. Oh, so one generation never really, it's not like, no, yes, we're exactly. getting no, no, years, no, 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 no yeah, nothing yeah. like that. No. So, um, what would have changed by the year would have probably been the CC rating. Okay. They would have or moved power. up from, yeah, from, from 1300, 1500, to know 1800. 1800 yeah. yeah so what about taxi now what are the taxi routes like in those times those ta taxi routes were more or less downtown to halfway tree yeah um people took taxis only like if they were sick or they had a special occasion yeah. you were going to a wedding and you were dressed up and that sort of stuff you wouldn't take the normal um, JOS bus. At JOS the time. bus, no. Mm. You, you you take a step up and. What's the ride like in these vehicles? Um, I actually had the honor of and privilege of driving a few of them. Yeah. Um, I learned to drive off of a Morris Minor first of all, mm -hmm. and then graduated to my uncle's Austin Cambridge. Um, once you move off in 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 first gear and you're, you're motoring along, 
um, and you, you actually come to a stop. Mm -hmm. like once you're on the flat, or even if you had a slight incline, you wouldn't have to put it back into first gear. Okay. Oh, and yes, to, note, right. to yes. note at this time, most cars were only synchromesh, ah, second, second and third. And third. What does yes. synchromesh mean? In other words, you can select the one gear. From second to one. From yeah. second to one. It, really? It would, yeah, it would no. grit and carry on, bad yes. like you weren't using the clutch. Oh. Not like nowadays. You can put a neutral and then find back a lower gear or so. No, or well, a higher gear. All no, right, well, so you're going fast and yeah. you want to um, stop. So rather than use the brakes, you cut the second. Yes, well, you can go from second to first. first no. Right, there's no second. The car has to come to a full stop. stop. Before, before you can, you can select, select first, first gear or move off in second. Yeah. Oh wow, yes. that's interesting. So yes. you're in traffic and you're you you you're totaling along. Yeah. Um, you, you select second, yeah. and you're able to move off quite easily, yes. even oh, on yes. an yes. incline, yes. Yes. because yeah. the engine was so talk at the time. Yeah. Right. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. So 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 you you have this car driving at the time now. Are you a privileged young man then to be driving? The, the the Austin Cambridge yeah. at the time. He must have been. He <laughs> must have been. Yes. So, uh, where do you carry had, a girl on a date now? At this time, with a car like that. Driving. Um, there was a driving. How about you driving? There were three drivings. There were three drivings. There was Harbour View, Boulevard. Boulevard. Uh, where was that the, one? The, the, these are some rude young men, you know. Yeah. Right? yeah. yeah. A girl are driving. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All right. Go on top. I would have been able to drive that car yeah. because my older cousins were privileged and they had their driver's license and I went for a drive with them. Uh, how I, old would you have been at this time? About 12, 13. Really? Yeah. Him, him good for you, you couldn't touch your father no, vehicle. You couldn't no, even dream. Because <laughs> your father would have been a discipline there, don't you? Exactly. It? That's exactly right. Yeah, so, yes. so tell me now, right? You, let's say you're 18 now. Right? Are you 21? When you started driving? I started driving from when I was 8 years old. But when you start driving from road, legal now? No, legal, um, I think I was 17 years old. How about yourself? About that, but a little bit older. 18 and a half, I think I got my license. And I do remember, it was at the stadium. They had um, the, the, the examination, the stadium. And the examiner put his nice fountain pen. Yeah, as behind, the roll back. behind, about a couple of inches right here, behind the rear wheel. Yeah. Say, young boy, see the pen? I want it back. Obviously, if you touch it, yes, that's it. You come back another time again. Right. Right. Yes. Oh wow. Okay. Yeah. So, you, so, in your your first car as a young adult, then is what? It was actually a Morris Marina. Okay. 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 Which was the same company. Yeah. It was just a step up, exactly. A couple of models up. The, the marina came in like seventies, in the, yeah, early early seventies, seventy one, seventy two, sixties. Okay. Yeah. Yes. Okay, then. So the Austin Cambridge stopped right. at about yeah sixty nine, sure. sure. mm -hmm. yeah, and then like seventy, seventy one, seventy two. So, you had you had a change in 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 in, in but model. You had, yeah, the Allegro before you had the marina. Yeah. So so, right? so, so let me ask you, I'm a top taxi operator at that time right mm. how do i get to be able to buy like a morris Oxford? you don't buy a Mar if you're a, a taxi operator uh -huh. they mostly bought second-hand cars okay. very very few new cars uh -huh. were bought by the uh, taxi companies they had mons taxi yellow cab yellow and checker cab, yes. and and checker checker. cab. oh right. land and yes. all people yes. so listen i need yes. this in the checker comment sec cab. section Anybody who knows about Checker Cab, right? Yellow Cab. Yellow Cab. And which one? And Mons Taxi. Mons Taxi. No, I know Yellow Cab silhouette. What does Checker Cab look like? The Checker Cab. It had red? It, no, it was the same brown and gold. No, it was. Yellow and gold. But it, 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 it the Checker. Black and white. Checker Cab. Black and white. No, it, it, no? it, it, it was a, I, it, I the don't, Check. I the check, the check was yellow. Okay. 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 And Yellow Cab, you had Yellow Cab. Written out yellow okay. cab on the okay. side oh. with the um with the with the, the fair structure. Yeah. Yes, right. On, on the, the side. side of the door. Yes. But the checker cab now had a yellow and black checker stripe going down the back and across the the the, the, the trunk lid. Similar oh. to what is now. So, similar, not not the same, but similar to similar the to root tax. Yeah, 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 yeah. So what about the other cab company that you tell me about now? What that one is? Mons. They were mostly black 
um, taxis and I think the top was yellow. I don't know. They were they were probably the first before yellow cab and I never cab. knew about people. I did not know about any of these I taxis. Don't remember. I only knew about yellow cab. I did hear about checker cab before, right? I didn't know. So how would you first of all how would you get a taxi then? Would you call the place or Yes, would you... you could call. You call and they had a they had a Pi radio system, which was the same radio system used by the police. Right. And so then they can't hear police then? Police. No, no, it's just I a different frequency. So. Okay, okay. I don't different think frequency. So. And how I know that there were these three popular um, cab companies, my father, as a, a watchmaker and a, and a jeweler, yeah. he had the dealership, the service dealership for Haldameter. Yeah.